In this video, I'm going to show you one of the best man beaters in Madden 23, and it comes to us out of the trips tight end formation in the New England Patriots offensive playbook. Now, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit the sub button. I do videos like this every single day. Also, if you want to get my entire trips tight end offensive ebook, make sure you join our Patreon. The link in the description um, is where you can get access to that. It's only $10 to become a member and it gets you access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks. All right, guys, drive post. One of my favorite plays for when my opponent is running a lot of man coverage. Here's how we're going to set it up. So what we're going to do to set this play up is actually really simple. Um, you do need outside apprentice for this, but if you have outside apprentice, it's going to make this so good. So uh, what we're going to do is we are going to take our outside apprentice receiver and we are going to put him on a C route. And then what I like to do here is take Calvin Johnson and put him on a streak. And then we're going to take our running back and we're actually going to put him on an angle route. So ideally hot route master as well. If you don't have the ability to do that, put the running back on an in, or if you're feeling like they might be pressuring you, go ahead and block the running back and then motion slant Calvin Johnson. So you see, it looks something like this. This play right here is so good against man coverage. Like you can throw this C route consistently against pretty much every kind of man coverage in the game. So the C route is the foundation of everything that we're gonna do from a man coverage beating perspective. And then the other things that you have is you have these really sharp cutting posts and corner routes that are really effective. So you're going to see here, um, I can throw this route to Taysom Hill. Now, the way you want to throw this route to Taysom Hill, it does depend a little bit on their shading. Um, but basically, you just want to freeform this uh, to the outside. So you'll see here, in that time, he wasn't able to beat man. But my post route over the middle was able to beat man. Man coverage is a little inconsistent this year, so it's actually rare that you find stuff like that. Like on this play, at least three of the routes are going to consistently beat man every single time. This this uh, this little slant to Calvin Johnson is really effective. The abilities that I would recommend if you're running the trip side in and you have your like pick of the litter from an abilities perspective, put short in elite on your inside trips receiver. Put short out elite on your outside trips receiver and then put route tech on your middle trips receiver this is also known as your slot receiver that's going to really help uh, in my opinion you get better separation against man now let me show you something real quick if i can get this guy out here a little bit more i think i can still throw that to the sideline ted hendrick's actually playing out of his mind over there on man coverage um, let me show you the angle route setup because i want to want to talk about the streak here in just a second but what you'll see here this time he's able to cook a little bit better so the tight end act will actually cook man a little better if you run the angle route because he's going to have better leverage at the snap of the ball so there you see the post route again cooking man now we're going to get to zone in just a second um, but I do want to talk about one other big deal with man, specifically with man press. So if they're running around some press man on you, this streak is really good. You're just going to basically highball and freeform it up and outside. As soon as you see that that streak kind of glitch, what happens is he kind of will glitch past Cromarty. Um, he'll kind of like, he'll like run with him and then he'll just kind of get instant separation. As soon as he gets that separation, we're going to high ball and free form it away from the safety. So in cover one, the safety is in the middle field. So we're going to high ball and free form it outside. However, let's say that they run uh, cover two man press. Okay. This is a great play for cover two man press because what you're going to notice is I can high ball and free form this to the right and have a decent chance to be able to hit Calvin Johnson over the middle of the field. And I'll show that one more time. Hopefully, we'll get a better uh, a better animation. But this has like changed changed the entire offense for me when I found out that the streak to triangle was one of the best routes in the game. Uh, you'll see here. Once he's even, he's leaving. Boom! Right in that little pocket. So again, cover two man is a little a little bit inconsistent in my opinion. There's actually a better streak in the play verticals where it's going to angle more toward the middle. But to me, like this is also really good on the short side of the field too. Um, this specific setup is actually really good on the short side, uh, which we'll talk about in the zone section here in just a second. But as you can see, kind of right in that little area. Again, Calvin's not going to animate for us because he hates me. Um, but let me show it to you one more time. 
so you see here again like if, if it's a deep if it's a deep third it's a lot easier um in my opinion because the deep third you just pass it to the left but if it's if it's something like this then you do have to kind of you know kind of get it a little bit so but you'll see which he's not going to beat at that time because he got a bad release so it is what it is but you're reading the release over there if he gets a good release where he gets that instant win to the inside then then throw it if not don't throw it okay now let's talk zone so zone coverage one of the best ways to beat cover two is to, is to utilize a setup like this so this is one of the best cover two beaters in the game so what we're going to do is you're going to see here that the c route is going to destroy man coverage to that side now the reason this is the the whole purpose of the streak to calvin while it is a really good press man beater the real purpose for this is in zone um and the main reason is because in zone now we're going to clear out some space uh to be able to attack with zone coverage so um if it's if it's any kind of cover four cover three what you're going to notice here is that this c route if i pass that down and outside has a pretty decent shot at getting open to the left side whether it be cover three whether it be cover four and and basically it, it amounts to like are they gonna are they gonna shade underneath in their cover three well they're gonna have to because we got we have you know our running back route right but what you'll see here really nice separation um against zone now the other way to beat zone that i like in this play is to basically take advantage of your slant post so what i would do with this is let's say they're playing cover four they're probably going to go user herman Moore, and so it's going to leave that right there okay so you either take your running back angle route or if you don't have high route master then just motion this guy over on a slant and you'll see here here's cover three sometimes when they do stuff like that you can still you get an access win to the corner okay it depends on how they adjust their defense but that corner route is actually like you would you'd be surprised at how much i throw that corner route against coverage okay uh and then like i said they're probably going to go user your post route because it's the best route on the play if they don't you can throw it kind of right in that little pocket the corner route to the tight end is going to pull the third so like if they're in cover three the corner route to the tight end is going to pull the third okay so like you see something like this right here you'll see this outside third get pulled by the corner route and then it leaves that little window little tight window throw right there again some of this depends on how they're going to use her okay some of it does depend on that but you can beat zone with this play um the c route is my favorite route against zone if they're in a cover if they're in a cover cover two and then if they're in cover three or cover four um you can either put the streak over here to help clear out zones or you can uh work your check down game with your corner route and then you've got your motion slant coming back across kind of right in that little pocket okay trip side in is an absolutely incredible offense if you want to get my entire trip side in offensive ebook head down to the description of the video and click the link down below